Oh, who cares? We'll just make it quick. If you want a quickie, you got the wrong girl. Ah! Oh. What now, Eric? <sighs> Nothing, forget about it. No, say it. I know that look you're giving me. Look, if you didn't want to come so bad, then why did you force yourself? I forced myself? Hey, look, I didn't force anything, okay? If I didn't come with you tonight, I wouldn't stop hearing you complain. I just... I just want a night with you alone, okay? I have plans for us. Yeah, but Eric, it's Elizabeth's birthday. I can't just leave her hanging like that. Yeah, it's a little last minute, don't you think? Yeah, well, shit happens. We can have an date any other time. We live together. Whatever. Look, I don't want to fight anymore, okay? If you didn't want to come so bad, why don't you just say something on the way? I didn't want to your night, that's all. Yeah, well, it's a little too late for that. Let's just go home. No. No, forget it. You know what? You're right. We're already here. Let's just, uh, let's just make the best of it, okay? Okay. I love you, Eric. You know, if you feel uncomfortable, we can just leave. Yeah, whatever you say, man. so big tonight. I kind of wanted a low-key jam. Oh, you know what? I like things low-key. But who's complaining? Let's party! Yes! <laughs> Woo! Let's party! Hey, Elizabeth. You forgot to introduce me. Mia, Eric. This is my boyfriend, Mike. Hey, nice to meet you. And Mia. Glad you guys made it. Of course, we wouldn't miss Elizabeth's birthday for the world. Mike wouldn't miss my birthday for the world. Isn't that right, baby? Only if the game was on. Then I would. You're so a jerk! I'm just kidding, babe. <laughs> uh, Mike, this is my boyfriend, Eric. Oh, sorry about that, mate. Didn't see you there. Yeah, apparently nobody can notice me tonight. Don't worry about it, man. Tonight's gonna be a good time. Who wants vodka? It's vodka time! It's vodka time! Elizabeth, can I talk to you for a second? Yeah, sure. Yeah, come on this way. Okay. So, you like vodka? You never told me you had a boyfriend. Yeah, I met Mike at this bar downtown like a year ago. He's so hot, right? A year ago? A year? Why didn't you tell me? I don't know. We haven't been in contact for a while. I thought I'd surprise you. Like, can we just go drink now, please? It's my birthday. Together, okay? Liz, there's something I need to tell you. Okay, ugh, Mia, stop your whining and relax. I haven't seen you in a year and you're complaining about my relationship, seriously? Can we just enjoy the night? I want all my loved ones together, okay? Fine, let's go. Promise? Fine. Okay, let's go, let's go. <laughs> Okay, okay, cheer. 
cheers. Cheers, Eric. To to what? To to friendship. To Mia. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Mia. <laughs>
Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. What's wrong? Nothing's wrong. Anyways, listen, uh, let's get in late. We, should... oh. we can't be leaving already. What? No! Why? I'd love to stay, guys. No, but I, I got... I got this thing I gotta do tomorrow morning, you know, I just, uh... uh we gotta go. It's gonna be we got a long way ahead of us. So, I think we should go. I thought you guys were gonna stay here for tonight. Yeah! Come on, Eric! Stay! Drink! I'm good, bro. I gotta drive. Thank you. Eric, there's no way we're leaving right now. You're so drunk. No, no, I only had a few drinks before. No, I thought you guys were gonna stay here for tonight. Eric, there's no way we're driving home right now. Rita's right, I think you should stay. No, I'm sick of your shit, buddy. Eric! Calm down. Let's go. He didn't do anything! The guy's drunk out of his mind, that's what's wrong. You know what? I'm sorry, ladies, but I gotta go. You can stay if you want, but right, I gotta go. I'm sorry, Liz, this is getting a little bit embarrassing. We're gonna get going. Oh, whoa, come on, guys. Stay, we're having a good time. Oh, shut up, Mike. What am I gonna do? Wait, Eric. Listen, I'm sorry if Mike offended you, but you guys just can't leave like this in the middle of the night. It's a long drive! Elizabeth, Eric has a point. Him and Mike are just not getting along tonight. I don't I don't think it's a good night for us to stay. I guess you guys are right. I don't wanna force you guys to stay if you don't want to. Okay, look, I can't make you guys drive all the way home tonight, okay? My dad has a guest house just a couple of miles up the road. Stay there, take all the time you need, and leave in the morning, okay? And besides, my parents are out of town, so... Oh, Elizabeth, that's so sweet. Look, Eric, we don't have to drive all the way home now. Please, I insist, it's the least I can do. Oh. I wish you guys could stay, but thanks for coming. Oh, Elizabeth, I love you. Listen, call me first thing in the morning, okay? I want to see you before you go. One Here's the address. Nice to see you, Eric. Yeah, thanks, Elizabeth. Drive safe, guys. We didn't pack any of our clothes. What's wrong with us today? That's all right. We'll just uh, <clears throat> just camp out tonight. Wait, I'm gonna go upstairs get some rest. Is there seriously no clothes I can wear? I don't know, this is in my house, Mia. Yeah, I know, Eric. You don't need to be sarcastic. I'm gonna go take a shower. You know, I don't 
I'm not even tired. Let's just get out of here. I can drive. No, I think we should stay. What are you talking about? Barry, this is not like us. We never fight like this. Yeah, it's just overreacted tight. Barry, will you ever leave me? You just love putting me on the spot, huh? No, seriously. I'm never gonna leave you beautiful. That's why you ask me such a thing. Listen, Eric, I really need to tell you something. Maybe this I'm tired. Okay, it's getting late. Why don't you just put the button? No, it's important. Seriously. Hey, hey. I love you, okay? We'll talk about this tomorrow, I promise. Just, I don't feel like having discussions right now. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. All right? Uh. sounded like a bang. It seems like someone's knocking on the door. <laughs> Probably a raccoon or a strange animal or something. It sounded like it just hit the door. No, Eric. It wouldn't have made a noise like that. It sounded like someone was banging on the door. Oh, don't forget, we were in the middle of nowhere. I mean, it could have been anything. Where were we? No, seriously, Eric. I'm scared. What was that? Why are you panicking so much? I told you, it's nothing. Can you just please enjoy the night? It's really late. Okay, maybe I'm just overreacting. <laughs> Yes, finally I convinced you about something. Shut <laughs> up. This house smells like shit. I know. There's someone there. What's happening? Eric, there's someone there. I don't hear anything. May I go back to bed shut the lights? Eric, no, wake up. There's someone there. Please wake up. I'm really scared. Mia. Mia. I have to get up early tomorrow. We got a long drive ahead of us. Can I please get some sleep? No, you can't. There's someone there. I'm really scared. Mia. I told you it's nothing. There's someone banging at the door. Just please listen to me. Okay, what do you want me to do? I'm going to call Elizabeth and see if there's anyone here. Yeah, you're really going to disturb her this time of night? It's a girl's birthday. Besides, she's probably busy with that weirdo mic. Stop being an ass. Are you being serious right now? Yeah, I am. Fine, call her. You're going to have service? I don't know. I'm going to check. Did you hear that? Shit. You heard that? Shit, hold on a minute.
I'm gonna go check it out. Yeah, I'm fine. See? What happened? Everything's fine. No one's here. I'll be up in a minute, right? I'm just gonna... I'm gonna make another search around the house. Eric, I wanna leave. Yeah, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna go upstairs and call Elizabeth, okay? Alright. Yeah, I'm just calling Elizabeth to let her know. I finally have service up here. Yeah, why don't you do it in the car? Because, Eric, there's no service here. I'm just gonna give her a call. Whatever you see, Mia. Come on, pick up, Elizabeth. Elizabeth, pick up. Hey, come on, it's my birthday. Oh, Elizabeth. Why are you acting like this? I'm just not in the mood, all right? What is your deal? Who's calling you this time of night? Mia. Mia? Hello? Elizabeth, hello? Mia, what's wrong? Is everything alright? Not really, Elizabeth. Me and Eric are getting ready to go home. What? Why? What happened? Honestly, it's nothing important. I don't want to scare you. No, you need to tell me- Now, Mia, what is going on over there? Is there anyone staying here that you don't know about? Or any neighbors living around here? Of course not, Mia. Why would I tell you guys to go there if someone was using it? I don't know. Maybe your dad has someone living here that you don't know about? No, no. I spoke to him already. It's just you and Eric in that house. Well, why are you concerned? What happened? Mia? 
Hello? Yeah, I'm here. Is everything all right? Yeah, I don't know, Elizabeth. We keep hearing banging on the door. I'm really starting to get freaked out. Banging on the door? That's odd. Yeah, I know, right? It's weird. Mia, you guys are the only ones there. <laughs> How could that be possible? I don't know, Elizabeth. I just don't know. Did you guys check and see what it was? Yeah, Eric checked. He didn't see anything. Then it's probably nothing, Mia. Don't worry about it. I'll be there first thing in the morning, okay? Honestly, Elizabeth, thank you. I just wanted to give you a call to let you know so you don't have to make the trip down here. Okay, look, now I'm worried about you two, okay? You guys just stay right where you are, and Mike and I are coming by, okay? No, Elizabeth, you don't have to. We have to go. It's getting really late. We have to leave. I'll just call you when I'm home. Elizabeth, wait! Too late! Love you! Let's go. Oh, fuck. Are we really going to see them? Yes, Mike, I'm worried about them. They keep hearing strange noises, Mia told me. Strange noises? Yes, now can we go? Oh. What'd she say? Is anybody else here? No, there isn't. She's already on her way. She's coming with Mike. Mike? Oh, fuck that. Let's go. No, wait. She's already on her way over. Mia, why don't you just call her back and tell her we're leaving? There's no point in having her come all the way over here. Message system. Send her voicemail. She's not answering. Alright, fuck it, let's go. Let me turn that on. Eric, where are you going? Stay here. Just stay there. Check it out. No, I'm coming with you. There's no way this radio turned on by itself. It doesn't make any sense. Let's get out of here, man. Let's go. Go upstairs, lock the doors, call the cops, okay? I'm gonna make another search around the house. No, Eric, don't do anything. Let's just leave this house. I care about our safety, Mia. Yeah. Maybe it's not safe to be outside right now. Just go upstairs and lock the doors, okay? Eric, I'm really scared. Hey, hey, baby, don't worry. It's probably some sick fuck playing a joke. Okay, just run upstairs. Call the cops. Quick. Okay. Eric, I have no service. Okay, then go in the kitchen. I've seen the house phone. Go see if that works.
I'm sure you see somebody there. I didn't see him. I didn't see anybody. No, nobody's there. I saw someone there. I saw okay, okay, okay. Yeah, please. All right, just. I need you to be here. Do you trust me? Okay, just hide. Can you do it for me? Can you hide? Okay. 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 Please do that. Okay, okay just okay. calm down, alright? Okay. Don't worry, everything will be okay, alright? Alright? Alright. Stick it. Where are you? Die yourself! What kind of pussy are you? Come on, man! I hit your fucking heart! I'll get out of your fucking throat! Stop screaming, okay? I'm just worried about them, okay? Okay, just wait in the car and I'm gonna go check on them. No, I'm coming too! No, you're not! Okay, I don't know what's happening, but it might be dangerous. Just wait in the car, the keys are in the ignition. Just go in and lock the doors, okay? You hear me? Lock the doors! Be careful, Mike.
Come on, guys. I'm too drunk for this shit.
Eric. 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 Eric? Jesus, are you okay? Eric, everyone is dead! I'm gonna try to get us out of here, okay? No. 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 Why are you doing this? Oh my God. Why are you doing this? Probably like, how's this possible? Mike, aren't you dead? There's probably a million things running through your head right about now. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I'm surprised you didn't help me when I was getting attacked. You just watched me get killed. You're so kind of you. You're smart. I give you that. This was all an act for you to come out. It was you. It was you all who did this. Well, of course! I'm standing here, am I not? Why? Why are you doing this? God, I love when someone asks me that. Why? Why? Why am I doing this? Maybe it's because you shattered my heart into a million pieces. That gives you reason to turn into a sick maniac? You sick maniac has to start somewhere, Mia. You guys just happen to be chosen tonight. What is this, a part of your plan? <laughs> I've always had a plan to get rid of you, Mia. Just because I was out of your life doesn't mean I didn't know about you still. What do you mean? <laughs> Before I start my side of the story, I think uh, Eric over here needs to listen carefully. <laughs> Don't hurt him, please! Don't hurt him, please! Oh no! You sound ridiculous, Mia! Don't worry, your precious boyfriend is safe here with us. Ain't that right, Buttercup? Anyway, so where was I? Oh yeah! I want to briefly explain to you and your boyfriend the true story. You see, Eric. I don't think your loyal girlfriend over here was so loyal to you after all. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> oh, wait. You didn't tell him? You didn't tell him that me and you were together? <laughs> wait. He doesn't know, does he? Would you look at that? Wow. <laughs> she probably told you that she didn't know me, right? <laughs> all that is lies. <laughs> she loved me. Me and her were supposed to get married. For Christ's sake, she lied to her only best friend. What kind of person does such a thing? Not to mention, 
She was the mother of my unborn child. Until one day, she decides to get an abortion. Because she couldn't stand being with me anymore. Because of you. She murdered our child for her own selfish reasons. She broke my heart forever. <laughs> so I decided I'm not gonna let this slide. So what did I do? I made her only best friend fall in love with me. Just so I can know everything about you guys. Tonight just happened to be the perfect plan. <laughs> Why? Why are you doing this? Don't you get it, Mia? <laughs> I was living with you this whole time. You just didn't see me. <laughs> You're a sick maniac. Did you ever think of that? I didn't want to be with you. <laughs> you brought the good side out of me. A side I never even thought existed. <laughs> Too bad. You had to bring that old side back out of me again. <laughs> to do this, Mike, it doesn't have to end this way. Yes, it does. Oh, I batted with this fucker. What does he need to say? I'm gonna fucking kill you. Oh, Mr. Tough Guy over here. Oh. <laughs> no, please. <laughs> no. I'd rethink what I'd have to say if I were you, Eric. I'm not the one chained up now, am I? Don't you fucking touch her. I'm not just gonna touch her, Eric. I'm gonna rip her apart. Peace. Peace. Oh, you motherfucker.
corner. Five-year-old male, back pain, to 211 Silver Hollow Road between Lane Road and Cross Patch Road. Back up 1227 first row. Yeah, James? Detective Stewart? Oh, 